hand things over to the developers of Tenebris Somnia, an 8-bit survival horror game with live-action cutscenes. Who's ready? My name is Okay, I think we are live. I am from Argentina. I'm tired. game developer. The game I am working on right now is Has there been anything good that's been shown? It's an old fashioned Yo, what's up, Inferno? Game like Resident Evil or Silent Hill or Fatal Frame. But the catch is that in certain moments you have a cutscene, and the cutscene is suddenly a live action. The original idea for the game came while playing the independent horror game Faith by Airdog. And I said, okay, let's do like. A uh, has has anyone game. seen this? Is this like, has this been good? I don't know. Horror game. When you see the monster, it's a. Bald guy or girl. I was trying to watch while I was working out, but I just I had to lock in. Disappointment 2.0. I think that's what's about to happen. But it's all. It's always the same. It got to be a cliche. So we have to really th think how the live action segments. When you make real film, you make the whole. Been thing. fine so you far. The beginning. This is mid. Turn it end. off. But here it's like you're filming small parts. What? Of the story, separated. So far it's been mid. The thing tough. That glues them together is the game. Tough. I Yo, really so have to be sure or of what I'm making because. I'm kind of the only one. Damn, that's really tough. You know, you, you know what's mid like. You really dude. see her face. Sonic or TFR, call it. Definitely Sonic. Actress, in, like, what's up, Exo? It makes you want more. Yeah, I just, I just got done lifting. Story. Anyone can understand. Just a little, magic, little four, monster, four sets. No, uh, four exercises. Anyone can understand a love story. Little, little four moment, by three. You know what I'm saying? Four, four exercises, three sets. Maybe Somnia will be out on Steam sometime around. High weight, low reps. You can follow us on Twitter to see some updates. You know what I'm saying? What? Yo, your mic's not on, bro. Yo, yes, mics are not. There you go. Chilling glimpse of Tenebris Somnia, which is coming to PC in 2025. But if you can't wait that long, a playable demo is available. TFR ain't coming ever. That's so tough. What is this? It's like spring, future game, spring showcase. We, we had this back. Uh, this was. When did the summer one? I can't remember. But we, we we did that for the summer. I can't remember when that was. It's like an eternity ago. Or, or was it for fall? I don't remember. My brain is mush. Yo, I, I dropped a 30 pound uh, dumbbell on my finger. My finger hurts. It's, it still hurts. PAX? PAX East? That's still a thing. And I miss E3, bro. I wish E3 would come back, for real. A 30 pound bomb? I mean, it felt like a 30 pound bomb. It literally dropped right on, like, my, my pointer finger. How am I gonna point at people and laugh now? Why are all these game shows so cringe? I wish I knew, man. I, I, I wish I knew. I can't believe, like, PAX East is still a thing. I, I, I'm surprised. I really am. Three hundred plus more to play. You're gonna build a R.I.D. Magnus cosplay, dude. That sounds heat. You should definitely do that. Pax East is taking place as we speak and runs until March the twenty fourth. If you aren't there yourself, check out twitch.tv slash Pax to keep up. To Orion Pax. Show related news. Back to it now, and we've got a new trailer for Dustborn, a road trip adventure game where you chart the divided states of America. So it's gonna be full of indie games. Maybe. Nearly 4,000 miles on roads less traveled to a place we've never heard of in service of a shadowy... Fellas, I, I gotta be honest. I don't know if I can have the comic video up tomorrow. <laughs> I'm pretending it's a weekend road trip. So, uh, Dom, so far, like, I just I just went live. Not even five minutes live yet. And from, from what people have said, it's been pretty mid so far. Let's not give them a reason to detain us. I, I I just finished the script for the video, so I'm gonna try and see if I can get it out tomorrow. But if not, Saturday for sure. Today today like this week was like a super long week. Be 
Did you miss anything? Team and teacher? Nah. Nothing. Do your friends even know what you do? Love walking to your game design class and reading the words your game has to be non-violent and help solve literacy issues. Oh, I, you know what I just thought of? I wonder if we'll see anything Borderlands related. I think I think they were like teasing like a sequel, like uh, like a month ago, which would be awesome. Cause like, I mean, I have a lot of issues with Borderlands Three story, but the gameplay is phenomenal. It's phenomenal. I gotta do a Borderlands stream one day. It's so good. Something about claptrap from Poker Night Two. I didn't even know Claptrap was in that. That's cool. Here's some more powerful words for you. Dustborn is coming to PlayStation, Xbox, and PC later this year. And we've got more to share about Dustborn in the official Future Games Show post show. So make sure. Your arch nemesis is here. Sam, come with me. How do you feel about cocoons? Cocoons? Yeah. You mm. know, a safe, quiet place to be nurtured. Synonymous with butterflies. What is this? Future game showcase. Um, well, our next game that is Ben Star. What is bro doing here? Wait, what's happening? Plans for 100% being a movie tie-in. Don't don't put that energy out there. Don't put that energy out there. I already have so many issues with that movie. Not yet rated. The sad thing is, people are gonna eat up that Borderlands movie. I'm like the number one Borderlands hater for the movie. Like, what are they doing, dude? Yo, this reminds me of Hollow Knight. What is this? Yeah, that movie does not look good. Damn. Damn, you know, talking about this, I want to I wanna pick back up on my Iron Man challenge for Borderlands. Borderlands 1. Iron Man challenges are so fun, but they, like, literally, it's so frustrating. I mean, Inferno, like, he, he literally just, like, he spat in my face and he, he, he sided with Taj. Uh, en enough is enough, you know what I mean? You know, like, uh, G Gregory claims he's a, you know, he's a he's a true G1 fan, but he, 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 don't, he don't even know, like, the difference between, like, Season 3 and Season 1 and 2, so, you know what I mean? Bro, bro probably doesn't even know that there's a Season 4 in G1. You don't know that. You know what I mean? He ain't tapped in. Void Rort is coming to PC and Nintendo Switch in 2024. Make sure it's on your wish lists. Void Rot. It it reminds me a lot of Hollow Knight. I never played Hollow Knight, but it's like those like platform type games. You're right. Though I think the writers may have over engineered the lead into our next game, don't you think? Just a bit. Halo Show Season 2 good. I I have watched it. I don't like it. I have I have a lot of issues with the finale, but you know what I mean, it's like I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna waste time complaining about it. Yeah, I, I don't think TFR will be here. It won't. That looked extremely Hollow Knight. I thought it was a cross horn for a second. Yeah, I. Okay, so I'm I'm glad that I'm not the one that thought of Hollow Knight there. Destiny in Unreal Two back on track. Can we get some like, like, like can we get like some like some uh, like a big time game? Who wants a release date trailer? All of you? Yes. Even you, Colin from Gateshead. Well, there's good news because we've got a good one for an open world survival. Crisis. Why can't they do this? Like, I, you know, I will say though, like, can can they just do? Can TFR just do that? Like, you're like, you guys want like some more news? Well, guess what? Tune in, tune in this date for TFR, and then, you know, just they show to the next game. Why can't they do that, dude? I know, I know, like, a lot of people want to, like, you know, blame, and, you know, Hasbro does have, like, have a huge blame when it, when it comes to, like, marketing, right? Like, we talked about that earlier this morning, but, like, people in, like, the Splash Damage Discord says, like, that's just how Splash Damage is, like, they'll reveal it, and then, like, right. when the game is ready, they'll show it. Is coming to Steam like, they just, the, Splash Damage is also, like, just really quiet, Infinity, you know? A squad -based FPS where players duke it out and we get one AAA game out of this one? Damn. Yeah, I, I, I hope we get good stuff, Little Miss. 
make a review of Halo Show Season 1 and 2. I'm not even just going to waste my time on that. Like, I've just, I've just, like, accepted that, like, that show's not meant for me, and that's fine. I'm going to watch the Fallout show, and that's probably... I'm probably not going to like that, but... It's whatever, dude. Like, you, like, you know, like, you know what's cooked? Like, I'll, I'll say this right here. You know the Fallout show's cooked? When, like, even my pops, like, my, my dad, he is not excited for that show. And mind you, this is the same person who, like, loved the Halo show. Like, he was, he was vibing with the first season. Granted... He's not like a huge Halo nerd like me, but like he's a huge Fallout nerd, and he's like, he's like that Fallout show looks terrible. So I don't know. All right, and like I already know like the Borderlands movie, like that's it's, I, I I wanted to bomb, but like it's whatever, dude. It's just not meant for me, and that's fine. Play Final Season 2. I have not. Tell me we're keeping score. That that game, that game kind of fell off. Ascendant Infinity. As something to adapt more video games and shows and move. That is true. That is true. That's that's a fair counterpoint. Yo, take care, Dom. Turn out your pockets, Ben. No, not again. I don't have anything. So I don't have. Okay, fine. You can have one thing, and that one thing will be my phone. Later this year, the Future Games Show will be delivering a showcase focused on mobile games. So to give you a taste of what's to come, here's a world premiere. Oh, oh my God, TFR mobile game? It was a bit about mobile games. <laughs> so am I gonna get? Am I gonna get that back, or is it? Am I just? Best thing will be, oh, dude, dude. If we get a first ascendant trailer here, I'll be so I, like this gets chalked up as a dub. I was I was swimming earlier today. Like, like when I, when I got off stream from this morning, I, I had some coffee. I went swimming. When I was swimming, man, you want to know what was going through my mind? I want first to send it. Like, I want that game to come back. Like playing Helldivers 2, like the, that, that game and the grind it has, it just makes me want first to send it back. And then when I play first to send it, I'll be like, man, I want TFR. <laughs> it's just like, it's just a never ending cycle. <laughs> Oh, but I, I miss First Ascendant, man. I really do, man. You have not seen proof that TFR is real? Oh, okay. Yeah, I mean, like, uh, that's the thing, Kaon, is like... I... I feel like... I don't know how I feel, honestly, when it comes to TFR. Like, obviously, I'm hopeful. But, like, I, I don't know... If I can really say I have a feeling that we're gonna see it soon, you know what I mean? I, like, there's just there's nothing that's like pointed or like made me feel like that, you know? Like I know we had like the it was uh, Sanders who said like you know the marketing and all that, right? And then you know we had Robo say that as well. Uh, like marketing start in spring. And, you know we're heading into spring, so you know what I mean? It could happen. But that, there hasn't just like there hasn't been really anything yet. We just gotta wait till Summer Games Fest. Foundation Galactic Frontier. Foundation Galactic Frontier is launching. My walls are quite comfortable, bro. Why don't you come out of the walls and uh? Be, be, I'll, I'll pull up a chair, bro. Rev, I'll pull up a chair. You can just sit right next to me. Let me watch this. Okay. As we all know, playing things like Fortnite to pass time until TFR comes out. Yeah, playing like Hell Divers Two has been really fun. This may sound a little goofy, but I miss Skylanders. Been on a nostalgia kick with that game lately. I never played Skylanders. Dude, Renji, Renji, you gotta do Hell Divers, dog. Like I want, like I wanna, like I just wanna see your reaction playing Hell Divers. Dude, like you, you'd kill me, bro. For example, most likely to win the hearts of Like, I can already see it now. You like see you like screaming at the top of your lungs most likely as like a charger's coming your way. <laughs> GTA 6 won't fail, but people will definitely be dissatisfied. Yes or no? Open my door. My door is open. Come in. Our first entry into this prestigious album, a psychological sequel with eye-popping graphics to boot. Your book? Oh yeah, Hellblade too. I don't. I, st I still just don't understand this. 
Not my front door. I think I think my uh, my dad will let you in. I don't even know what this game's about, but I just always see like people hyping it up. Blade Sinua's Sacrifice, a story-driven action adventure game from Cambridge developers Ninja Theory. Hellblade is memorable for its myth-infused world and unique approach to psychological horror. Protagonist Sinua suffers from psychosis, represented by a cacophony of binaural voices commenting on her. Dude, that that new Captain America game, that shit looks awesome. Awesome, dude the graphics is crazy i do have a gripe though i don't like the va for captain america <laughs> i don't like it yo she like she schizo electrifying debut at the game awards in 2019 which uk mentioned chanting versus games are decent skylanders that's someone like you like put the things on like you like buy the like buy like the little things and you like put it on like the game console right I might think of something else. And they had a new Marvel game. Yeah, it's like, I think... It's called 1943, Rise of Hydra. It's like Black Panther, Captain America. It's so cool. her village and killed her lover. The Furies also haunt Sunua in the second game, taunting Sunua about looming death and the fate of those around her as she strives to rebel against tyranny in 10th century Iceland. What's like, what's so cool about like that, that Marvel game though, is like they say at the beginning, like now there's three super soldiers. Obviously the layman's answer is everyone's like, it's like Red Skull, but like, bro, like what if, what if it's like, what if it's the Winter Soldier? What if it's like someone else? What if it's like... You know what I mean? Super soldier, you know, well Weapon X, you know what I'm saying? That would be cool, bro. That'd be cool. Weapon X. Been on a huge X-Men kick lately, and I love it. I love X-Men. How's it going, Navir? It's like the first Toys Alive video game before Amios and Disney Infinity. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, okay, then I know what you're talking about. Yeah, my, my sister, I think she she dabbled in Skylanders, or, was, or maybe it was my brother. I never got into it. We won't have to wait too long to lose ourselves to this extremely exciting narrative. Sunua's saga, Hellblade 2, is set to launch on May 21st, 2024. Didn't this game have, like, multiple delays? Like, I feel like the only thing I see people talk about this game is just, like, the graphics. I don't know. I feel like that game might be a little overhyped. That's like an Xbox game, right? I think Razor Hydra you get to play as... A U.S. soldier and Wakanda spy as well as the main two. That seems interesting. Is it is it a co-op game? Or is it single player? Rogue is your favorite mutant? She bad. Every time you the Tomb Raider games you played as a kid. The 3D one. I always wanted to play the Tomb Raider games. But apparently, like the the ones that have come out like lately, are like not good. Your father instructed me to play this message. Spider-Man better than all X-Men, yo, Joba. A message from Dad? I can't believe. If you guys haven't watched X-Men '97, I recommend it. It's so good. The, the the animation is amazing. It's it's literally like a comic book came to life. It's awesome. They they finally give my boy Cyclops the respect he deserves. The Fox movies always like hit him so bad. So good. He was supposed to be a routine. Mission. So good. But something went terribly wrong. X-Men 97 is peak Magneto carry. What's so great about it though is like you don't even gotta watch the the OG animated. Like they they literally give you a, a recap on everything. That's so it's so good. It's like it's like it's standalone, but it's still a continuation. It's so cool. Like you don't even gotta watch the OG. If anything, I'd recommend people to like watch 97 now and then go back and watch the OG. The awesome. A fan of Into the Spider-Verse. Miles is cool. Haven't seen the sequel though. Sequel's really good. You gotta watch it. Sequel's fantastic. Oh my goodness. Across the Spider-Verse. Whew. That's that's some peak cinema. From far off. And in close range. Battle Juice Alchemist. Oh, Metal Alchemist. Amazing Spider Man's Peak Cinema. You lost me. You lost me. Go get them on your wish lists.
Reckon 2025, 2026 could be peak gaming. Uh, most likely. I mean, like, you literally have... GTA is going to take everything by storm next year. Feel bad for any, like, huge game coming out next year. Because GTA is just going to overshadow it. I mean, isn't that what happened, like, in 2018 with, like, Red Dead 2? Like, there were some pretty good games, right? And didn't, like, Red Dead 2 hey, just, I'm like, Thomas overshadow Bala, everything? Hey, I'm Gennady, and I'm a production and technical director, and both of us are the founders of Moon. Moon. Creators of... Oh, I... Okay, I remember seeing this. I remember seeing this. We are working on our new... Sam Raimi's trying... Is saying his four Spider-Man movie is coming out. That's hype. Project, right? I, the, I, the, I... Dude. Dude. I always wanted to dude. Play. And wanted to play Dad. many years now. I, I freaking I love one of the best combat systems on the market. Love Tobey Maguire Spider Man. Change how exploration Real on that. Right, that you're not just walking around. I really want like an open world transfers game where you get to make your own character. Dude, yeah, that'd be, that'd be sick. Aspect, combine that with all these imagine like a imagine like a single player. You know what I mean? Open world. All of those things. It's the kind of make your own bot. See, uh, Man. Making, but because they didn't make it. It is kind of unfortunate they never expanded upon what High Moon did in the multiplayer. Or you could create your own transformer. It really is a shame. The big thing for us to tell people. Andrew Garfield, best Spider-Man. You, you lost me. Look into no you lost Wicked, me. Uh, the more you would understand that what we're you trying to do is kind of create our own mix. So we will look at any particular genre, and we would take the elements from this genre that we are excited about. We put it all together into one game, and then yeah, it was Transformers so Universe, but I mean, like combat inspirations. That was more like a series, Monster Hunter animation. It was more of an MMO. I don't know. Fighting games. Like what what I'm picturing is like combos, things that have special moves. I'm picturing like a single player story, in, in open world way, type thing. You know what I mean? Like exploration. You know, interconnect. I agree, Renji. Hopefully, with Transformers, if Transformers One's like a huge blockbuster, like the that opens up the Pandora's box of getting stuff like that. And the reason why that is is because like Transformers One's like such a different, unique take. So like it literally could. If, if, if that movie puts TF back in mainstream, we have a higher chance of getting stuff like that. So yeah. Perfect version it can be. No Maybe a high moon bit making is that you can have you can have a torso that doesn't waiting. determine your all. Yeah, I think that I think that's that literally. No I think just at the time they couldn't just they couldn't do anything access, about that. They just had it and it's coming to connected. And Xbox, and we've got even more exclusive details about that one. Are seeing some in the main story? Yeah. Okay. Up next is a new. Needs to let loose on the IP a bit, and we could. I dude, I agree, bro. I think, like, the new CEO that joined, like, a couple years ago, like, he understands that vision. Like, he wants to have more TF media. So, you know what I mean? And the colors. I don't understand how in WFC we had, like, a full-on color picker system. And then in FOC it was just, like, it was just palettes. It was just, like, coatings, basically. It's about survival. What is happening? Are those zombies? Yeah, the art style is like very like 8-bit. That seems interesting. Holston is coming to PlayStation, Xbox, Switch, and PC when it's ready. Oh, when it's re <laughs> when it's ready. Whoa. Whoa, what is this? This looks like Anthem. What is this? Among the ruins of a shattered earth, humanity rallies against an overwhelming invader. Yo! For survival. Using powerful suits, humanity suddenly stands a chance against a mighty foe. This reminds me of Anthem. Battle to win. Nah, this looks too good. What's the catch? Nah, what's the catch? What is this? Blue boxes? Dear God. 
forge alliances and fight for glory. Join the fight now. Eve 2? EV2 is coming EV2. to PC in early 2025. Huddle up, fellow RPG fans. Now, I understand the Dude, Anthem was so good. Dogma is coming out in a matter of hours. I love Anthem. But like there was nothing to do in that game. Not to make the 12 year wait any it, yo, Anka does. It does, bro. Capcom has sent us a fiery trailer to prepare you for launch. In a realm of fantasy. That game, that game doesn't look too bad though. EV2? As a chosen hero bestowed with immense power, a nefarious wielder of great magic, a conqueror of monsters. Yo, what is this? Hold up. Now Let him cook. What is this? Take your place among the worthy. Forge bombs. Gather allies. Fulfill your Yo, this gives me other school vibes. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Go forth, Arisen. Follow thy heart to seek the truth. Oh, it's Dragon's. Oh, dude. Dude, Dragon's Dogma 2, bro. I see so many people like talking about it, dude. I want to check that game out so bad. That was the and like the character creation is like so like good. March 22nd on PC, play it comes out tomorrow. We've got something really I'm broke. special for you now. Our next trailer will be accompanied by a musical performance. Ooh, Clive and Carl like do karaoke. I was thinking we could do Eternal Flame this time. That sounds great. Oh, the producers are shaking their heads. They'll regret this at the rap party. Anyway, instead, we're throwing it over to LA for a special performance of Home to Home from the Haunty soundtrack. Oh, and look out for a release date announcement as well. The first game was very good. You made me broke. You made me buy Omega Prime. F41, one and two and three and four and... Oh, dude, is this a song? I don't want to catch a... I don't want to catch a... I don't want to catch a strike, bro. Yo, what happened to my other tab? Did it to make me stronger? Why would you do that? Why would blood do that? Uh, hold on. Hold on. Trust the process. There you go. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about this. Rise of Ronin? What, which one's Rise of Ronin? Become stronger anymore? Hate and motivation? I don't want to be a hater anymore, man. No more. No more. No more hating. I, I hate when gaming events do this. Like, do they do like a musical concert, and then like they say it's like, oh well, you know, people can watch our events, and then like you catch DMCA. Like what? Rise of Ro oh wait no okay I remember Rise of Ronin I remember now. That's only a PlayStation game though, right? Tough. That's tough. TMNT? Nah, it's a different game. Is this where we'll see Transfer Directory like Trailer 2 in the live stream? Probably not, boss. I'd say most likely not. Oh, they're still singing? Tough. Let your hatred consume you, some lizard in a robe. No more hating. That's how this game is nice though. I agree. Yeah, 
Check out TFR as kind of advertised for other game developers. Wholesome. Does TFR exist? Is TFR simply the friends we made along the way? Precisely. <laughs> is coming to PC, PlayStation. It was all a construct. I knew it. 23rd, 2024. And you can watch the full reveal trailer on the FGS YouTube channel. Our next and someone just dropped something. A fiend called Beelzebub as they try to survive in a that was loud. world ravaged by water shortage. Let's check out a brand new gameplay trailer for Sandland. Peggy 12. Yo, Toriyama. In both the bright light of day and Dude, the we should we should watch the Sparking Zero. I pledge to devote my entire being to and do all in my power for this great nation of forest land. Yo, what's up, Supersonic? What's up, Slayer? What's up, Ranger? They're the Forest Land Army. The Forest Land Army is really something else. Starting off as the underdogs? Sounds like my kind of Did you just start? Just you wait. Eh, not really. I'm gonna need you to hand over that aquanium to me. General Crowa. Right is relevant. I remember this game. One person's right is another person's wrong. Demons are no match for the illustrious Rosetta Brigade. Listen, Rosetta! We can resolve this if you'll just talk to us! Keep your naive ideals in your diary. Aquanium! <laughs> or shown quite a bit of mid. Our army will control the entire world. For the sake of those lives lost. For our great patriots. Yeah, Rip, Rip Toriyama, dude. I'll lead you back to the path of righteousness by ridding this world of demons. What? He's a match for the prince? Fiend prince. Why do you lend these humans your strength? <laughs> Yo, Forget about me. Keep the Aquanium safe. I don't go by Shiva anymore, though. Now. Better start thinking before I run out of patience. He's not human. Muniel is an angel. Nice. April 26th. Demo playable now. Santos. Okay. Sorry, that trailer was in um, 4D. Sandland is coming to PC, PlayStation, and Xbox. That was real good. April 26, 2024. This next trailer is for Space Prison, a game where you break out of a galactic complex by crafting contraband, brawling inmates, and raising an army of mutant rodents. No TFR, you already know it. Damn. Damn, son. Death is not an excuse for a shorter sentence. Space prison. Are you ready to be king of the rats? You better be, because space prison is coming to PC. Dude, can they like please show like a like a full on like now AAA it's game? Time to reopen the future game show ones to watch yearbook and hand out one of our prestigious badges. Our next entry is an open world smuggler's tale that will have you infiltrating wretched hives of scum and villainy. Blood, yo, blood. Steal all your free, okay, Star Wars game. Star Wars Outlaws, there you go. 
I've been actually curious about this game. Far, far away, Star Wars Outlaws speeds its way into the pages of our future game show, Wants to Watch Yearbook. Let's jump! Outlaws is a third-person scoundrel simulator from open-world maestro's Massive Entertainment. Known for spearheading Tom Clancy's The Division and last year's Avatar Frontiers of Pandora. Yo, this looks decent. I think that went pretty well, right? In the sacred timeline, Star Wars Outlaws sits between The Empire Strikes Back and Return of the Jedi, and stars enterprising outlaw K. Vess. Boasting an adorable. Re uh, is Return of the Jedi? Is that. Bodyguard in a trench was that is that Anakin era or Darth Vader era? Vess sets out to become a household name in the underworld by planning heists and schmoozing with syndicates. So, yes, you can expect a few. Episode 5 and 6? With Jabba the Hutt. It's not the first time we've okay. As well as engaging in gun and gadget fueled infiltration combat, which inevitably leads to high speed escapes. You'll dogfight in your ship, the train. the Jedi's Vader era? Okay, okay, okay. Cities, cool. Deserts and hives. From Tatooine to Kajimi and the planets between, you'll score credits, smuggle goods, and make difficult choices to manage chaos. Like what like what are like Star Wars fans like preferred timeline? Do like do like do people like when it was like you know Anakin era like that uh, what's the uh, the Clone Wars era or do they like it like when Darth Vader is out and about with the the stormtroopers or like post that with like Kylo Ren and shit all I know is they don't like new stuff yeah a lot a lot of people don't like this stuff. I, I've never seen them. I've never seen the the new movies. I I'm yeah, not I'm not in the Star Wars like that. Star Wars Outlaws into our Once to Watch yearbook, and we'll be bringing you more coverage on the future games. Well, so like the sequel era, we move closer to the prequel era. era. Okay. What's next, Ben? Clone Wars era, but I think everyone can agree that the sequels are trash. <laughs> not this again. Help. Leave him alone. Your bro's tweaking. How dare you bully him? Only I get to bully him. Are we clear? Bro is tweaking. Blockbuster Inc. lets you go behind the scenes and run your own movie studio, picking stars and setting scenes in a bid to sweep up the awards. Does the Star Wars sucks? Didn't, uh, didn't people like Ahsoka? Yeah, so that's all we saw for Outlaws, bro. I want more. That game looks decent. From the worst cinematic nightmares. Oh hi, Tom. Hi. To an unforgettable, masterful cinematography. Please? Oh my god, the Barbie movie. I never watched the Barbie movie. Game where you make your dream movies come true. Try reading the Dreamwave TF comics. I want to. The Dream Dreamwave era looks awesome. I like the art style. This is like a, a sim game with like Hollywood stuff. Was TF revealed? Yeah, bro. How long has this been going? Anything good? No. Everything's been mid for the most part. Except for Outlaws. Outlaws looks good. Nurture your movie stars. Dude, TFR trailer was hype for real. <laughs> this is like a sim game. But like a like a builder, I don't really I don't really vibe with those type of games. It's never really. Oh my God, it's Homelander. Blockbuster Inc is coming to PC on June six, twenty twenty four. Wait, was it really real? Did I miss it? <laughs> here to reveal some exciting news about the future. Dude, the part where Optimus Prime said, "This is Transformers Reactivate," that was peak, bro. When he said, "Autobots, we must reactivate." Dude, chills down my spine. <laughs> Team Archer was awesome? Yeah, it was awesome. I mean, like, when Bumblebee said this truly was our Transformers Reactivate, I was like, wow. Peak riding, dude. 
<laughs> when he said, let us be done with this guy. <laughs> yeah, Skyward was just like shown. Let us be done. What's up, the eggs? <laughs> yeah, hot, dude, Hotshot was peak in the TFR trailer. Yeah, it was cool. He was like, party's just started. And he just, he just gets shot. That was unfortunate. Megatron transformed into a toilet, dude. When Megatron transformed into a toilet and said, "Prime, sit down," I was like, "Holy shit!" I can't, I can't believe they're going with that storyline. I, I, I couldn't believe it. Yeah, when Hot Rod got in the way, but yeah, when Hot Rod got in the way and sat on the toilet, yeah, that was crazy. Wow, that shit was crazy. At least we made it out of reactivated, dude. That. <laughs> Chills down my spine, bro. I didn't I didn't think they'd have Beachcomber say that. I didn't expect the Beachcomber cameo. Red alert signal of the middle finger? Dude, nuts, dude. Cosmos Evan shoot star strength through the spark was nuts. Yeah, dude. I find it very interesting that they're making TFR a mobile game and it's a it's a platform game. Platformer. Throughout time Interesting. And antiquity, the golden <laughs> blocks of society have been based on democracy, debate, and compromise through peaceful deliberation. But yeah, dude, when Sarshan started throwing it back, I was like so confused. I was like, wow. I mean, like, a little bit like when I saw like Soundwave confess his love, I was like, ah, I saw this coming. You know what I mean? Like, I always knew Bro had something for him. Yeah, dude, when, when Peter said, this game's coming, 2095, I was like, holy shit, no way. Paying a monthly subscription to TFR? Yeah, man, I I like how you need to get the, the loot boxes. You have to buy loot boxes to uh, progress through the game. I think that's that's how you do it, man. <laughs> Sam with Wiki. You know what we're doing. Oh, it's popping! Oh my god. Your TFR loot box subscription is pre-ordered? Hell yeah, dude. Yeah, I like how you can um you can get it at Walgreens. It's like it's like you're getting like, you know, medicine. It's like a prescription. That's cool, man. Rumble Club is coming to PC and mobile this April. Our next game has musical contributions from none other than Rick Astley. And we promised this isn't some elaborate bit. We wouldn't want Spike to was mind controlled, like yeah. Yeah. We'd never TFR is my drug of choice. <laughs> uh yeah, hello, your uh TO4 uh prescription is uh is coming. Mom! Oh, what is it? Are you sure we can't go back to our old house? You'll soon get used to it. Same wiki was Spice Evil Twin, dude. I I I, I, I couldn't believe my eyes. And who might you be? I'm Simon. Don't you remember me? Look here. This is a prequel. So what do you think I should do? The little miscreants have a nerve to steal from me. I demand to know who we're dealing with. Yeah, it's pretty wild that Thundercracker was like just try trying to like riz up uh, Starstream. I don't know, Come man. On, Simon. Get the magic books. McKay's daughter said we gotta try and reactivate, reactivate them. Yeah, I didn't think they would mention Age of Extinction. Hello, your TFR prescription's ready. Oh, okay, I'll be on my way. Simon the Sorcerer Origins is coming to PlayStation, Xbox, Switch, PC, Apple, and Linux in 2024. So point and click it into your wish lists. Now, we know you love a good teaser. This again. Look, ben, I know you are yeah, Thunderkirk got that friend that zone system. rip. This is a strictly turn -based you see the Swiss Prime skin for 2700 oh, uh, RB? Reactivate Buckaroonies. Um, yeah, dude, they didn't even give me the skin for free. They're like, they're like, we made you the skin, but like, you gotta buy it yourself. I'm like, bro. It's like, I'm broke. Come on, what is this guy? They're like, too bad, bud. It's a good gag. I, li I literally had to call up Richard Jolly. I'm like, yo, can you slap me some. Uh, can you, can you slide me some reactivate buckaroonies? And he said, he said, sorry, Brev. Like, damn. It, it, it really be your own, man. I thought me and Richard Jolly were like tight like that. Tough.
When Bulkhead peed on Jerry. What? Yeah, worth one per 50 US dollars. Yeah, man. It's, it's, it's rough. It's rough out here. Yeah, Dom, yeah, we, we're going insane. Project Mango is a collaboration between Tukana Interactive, developers of Dorf Romantic, and YouTube animation maestros Kortzgesagt in a nutshell. Is this TFR it's showcase? It already happened, bro. Sorry. Up next, we've got the latest Sorry, bro. update on Outpost Infinity Siege, a first-person shooter with base building and tower defense elements. It's over. Forget our old doomsday scenarios. In the end, our pride and avarice was to be our downfall. More Optimus said it's priming time. Yeah, when he's like Autobots. It's priming time. <laughs> I was like, holy shit. Yo, this game actually looks pretty cool. Armored core, but first person. 5,000 5, USD for the Swiss game? Hey, man, it's worth it, bro. Worth it. Worth it. When Optimus said skibbity toilet, he didn't say that. Look in general. What? What? What do they do to my bro Hot Rod? This actually looks decent. It's the Mungus. The Among Us alarm. Outpost Infinity Siege. March 26. All right, cool. Me and, me and Rich will be on this game. Looks generic. Outpost you don't mean that. Siege is you don't mean that. Coming to Steam on March 26th. We're taking a trip to the Scottish Highlands now to hear the latest on Farewell North, an atmospheric puzzle adventure starring a border collie and its owner. Yeah, when Wheeljack said it's jacking time, I was like, holy shit. Comics reference? UK mentioned? Let's go! Other said it's Morbin time. Yeah, when he said that, I was like, dude, Morbius is in the the game. Hell yeah. I mean, they're gonna need they're gonna need Morbius to stop the Legion. Yeah, when when Optimus started to do the Fortnite dance and gritty dance, I was like, holy shit. Like that's that's when I knew this game would be peak. See how far looks gray here. Yeah, this is the, one of the expansions for the game. Awesome. Yeah, bro was hitting the gritty. Morbius and <laughs> the Transformers, dude, completely lost my shit, dude. Like it, like it's just, it's peak media. Like like when Morbius soloed Megatron, I was like, holy shit! Like that was just, I just, I couldn't. Thank you for your help, Caleb. I couldn't believe it. Oh, I and Mr. Chesley, of course. Pack your hiking gear because we're pleased to announce that Farewell North is coming to peace. Yeah, I didn't like that part when Madam Web saved Starscream. That was like, I don't know, that was bad. Our next game will have you praying to the gods for help as you take on hordes of Draugr in PvE combat. Okay, hold up. This actually might be good. Hold on, hold on. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. My name is Mark Jacobs. Uh, I am the CEO slash... Chief Creative at uh, now Unchained Entertainment. We're currently working on three things, Final Stand Ragnarok, Camelot Unchained, and the Unchained Engine, which powers uh, the games that we're making now, the games we're gonna make in the future, and also, of course, the name change. It's been a while. They should just, like, to not be cowards and give us First but Ascendant. The key thing for us That's what they should do. Never gave up, 
And now we're at the point where not only is FSR ready to launch, but our engine can do things that no one else. Then I was joined to so Matrix Leadership out of Optimus said, I am that of I am the. Like, he didn't say that, bro. Like, just say so you didn't watch the trailer. He literally said, he said, am Thanos and snapped his fingers. Like, you didn't watch it, bro. Like, come on. The really cool part about it. He literally said, am Thanos and snapped. Many more entities than you see in other engines. To Come on, Rich. Come on, man. Ragnarok, it is the few versus horse that's how I interpret it. Enemies. <laughs> is that, that's your head cannon? <laughs> I, I forget when it when it comes to uh, when it comes to this type of stuff. Head cannon trumps all. I forgot my bad. <laughs> this is a game that doesn't try to take itself too seriously. We're also gonna have what? Yeah, you just started default dancing. Fridays. You turn the gun. Uh, Funny shit I've ever seen. Players, <laughs> Like, and, then, and then Megatron turned into a gun. It's the funniest shit I've ever seen. Hey, oh my god. A little harder. Or maybe instead of That's the rich verse? Dude, hell yeah. Coming in a way, we're gonna make 500, make them a lot more powerful. Yeah, I didn't like that Morbius killed Red Alert. With them. No matter how well you thought things Cliff proposed to RC, you cried? Yeah, I don't know why they gave Cliff Jumper a happy ending. Once they played uh, kind of an L. I want to see what they like, what they don't like. And I'm just kidding. I'm, I'm, I want a happy ending for my guy. It is so easy for no more pain and misery for him. You know, in a scenario, being able to do that. Just start story, story writing. I mean, hey, man, you you never know. Gives us such an edge in iteration, and certainly the scale is always going to be, you know. Our the Morbius kill Cliff. No. Oh! If you would like to experience what it feels like to be in that moment, the middle of Helm's Deep, fighting the onslaught, uh, you're really going to like. Jazz showed up at Sam's house as an Uber. Right <laughs> Uber eats delivery, March, dude. No way. Uh, in March, PC of course, and then over the remainder of the year. Bridge, you were so sad. Yeah, when when Braun died to Ebony Maw, so tough, dude. So tough. Yeah, when Ratchet said, I ain't got time for this shit, I was like, oh my god. Nefir? Is that you? Final stand, Ragnarok will launch on PC this month with console versions. Yeah, I was, that was kind of an L by Sam, not not it's not tipping. The ones to play montage, not tipping enough to, to the boy jazz, awesome games to the go. That will be available to play right after the show. Just head to the future game show Steam page where you'll find all the featured demos. Yeah, when Iron Knight stepped on Batman, I was like, your wish list but like, they they had to write off Batman. Like you knew, like because you know, if you give Batman prep time, he can stop anyone. So like. It's a, it's a cop out way, you know what I mean? It's, it's, it's kind of a cop out, but you, you had to write them off somehow. Alright, 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 no more. Like, Sonic, you ruined it. Nah, you ruined it. Like, nah, <laughs> I'm done. Bro ruined it. And here's Go Go Town, cartoon sandbox where you rejuvenate a rundown city. Up next is Follow the Meaning, a peculiar point-and-click puzzler starring a detective with a delightful trilby. Angerfoot is sliding in now. A light Angerfoot? Yes. Who comes up with these names? Into kick-ass. Or how about Duck Paradox, a disco-dancing bullet-hell platformer where you rescue your web-footed workmate. Yo, that, okay, I'm not gonna lie, that game actually looks pretty cool. An action RPG where you combine the personalities of fallen warriors. And remember, all these games are available to play for free. For free? Right after the show. Yeah, I might play that duck game. That game looks pretty crazy. Thanks to everyone. <laughs> Bronson said make a to a free demo for the ones to play section. Oh my god. And speaking of free games, why not take a look up here? Megatron. If you're one of the people lucky Dice. enough to claim one of these, then you just got yourself access to a time-limited playtest of Go Go Town. So get Go Go going. And I suspect they're all Go 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 Gone now. So, here's a gameplay trailer for Terratech Worlds, a multiplayer survival builder perfect for fans of Valheim and Satisfactory. Valheim? I haven't played Valheim in... since it came out, dude. Decepticons. <laughs> Dead. I think we'll watch the G1 movie today.
This is actually TFR. It's an expansion. Rev your engines. It's an expansion. This Terratech Worlds is coming to Steam Early Access on the 22nd of March, which is tomorrow. Time to slip on your dancing shoes now, as we've got a psychedelic rhythm shooter where you empty your clip to the beat. What is this? Minecraft Car Edition. One, two, three, boom! Target acquired. Target's location. Working Yo. This actually looks pretty crazy. Wow, so many choices. I feel like this is something Green Arc would play. Like I see like Green Arc sending like a clip of this game one day. It can't be this easy. Ah, it wasn't this easy. Robo B. Shoot to the rhythm. You think the next Skybound video will come out? I Love Maybe it. tomorrow, but for sure Saturday. Robo Beat is Check Discord. Steam and Epic Game Store on my May favorite 16, moment. 2024. So, All right, I need bleach for my eyes. Also, a demo is available right now, so you can dive into the show. Now, if you fancy yourself something of a contemporary Sherlock, this next game's for Go you. Go take care, Lomas. The operator has you analyzing evidence to solve impossible, sometimes improbable cases. <laughs> Someone knock me out. Screen. Welcome to the FDI. Oh my god. Tanner. As our newest operator, your role is to support our agents in the field. Using cutting edge software, investigate mysterious crimes, dig for clues, Un uncover the truth. Good luck. Oh my god. The truth is out there. You just have to know where to look. The operator is coming to PC. Dude, this is the game Rich made. Okay. Rich made this. Nice, bro. It's time to jump into our ones to watch yearbook for the last time in the spring showcase. And this entry comes with a special treat. But just before we get into it, a little scare warning for those afraid of uh, mm, vicious storms. Damn it. Uncertain circumstances. Infestations of otherworldly horrors that slowly seek to destroy you and everything you hold dear, and the North Sea. <gasps> Still wakes the deep. Emerging from sinister depths, the Chinese room's first-person psychological horror game Still Wakes the Deep has found a home in the future game show Yo, this looks Watch crazy. From the narrative magicians behind Everyone's Gone to the Rapture and Amnesia, a machine for pigs, Still Wakes the Deep is a rich tome of terror that seeks to push your panic buttons. Oh my god. Players step into the steel-toed shoes of an oil rig worker. Waiting for TFR news is like waiting for Goku to save you. Look for answers in the isolating labyrinth. What if I'm Goku? Of a 1970s drilling platform stranded in the north. Hey, it's me, Goku. You look strong. <laughs> Bro's not him. I'm literally him. And to sate the appetites of our scare hungry viewers, we've been working to bring you a terrifying new trailer that will reveal when you can get your hands on it. I heard your TFR's addiction strong. Let me fight it. I still Dead. can't believe you went. What are you thinking? Going to that place. Wish you hadn't got yourself into this mess, but you did. You can't run forever. If I peek at Rainbow Six Siege, I'm surprised like that's like even a thing. I know you were just trying to do right by me, so I need you to do what's right by us now, please, Cass. I am so tired of fighting. I just want it to be over. I want you home. The girls want you home, but. If you don't deal with this, then we are done for good. 
I love you. But I won't wait forever. I agree, Rev. That game seems interesting. I wonder how much uh, it's gonna cost. Wait, maybe, maybe for a whole, like a horror stream, we check it out. Maybe, maybe. You heard it here first. Still wakes the deep is coming to PS5, Xbox, and PC on June eighteenth. Let's look at Battle Crush now, a multiplayer action brawler where you fight like gods. Goku showing me TFR. It's me, Goku. Feet. I heard the Legion strong. Let me fight it. Annihilates the Legion. <laughs> Go Goku solos. What about Gohan? Gohan's that dude. Go like my my favorite DBZ character is Gohan. I love Gohan. He's the GOAT! Giyata Giyata Cop? No way. Yeah, how's it going, Cougar? Broly is the best. Dude, bro, I got... I'm gonna watch the... The Hero movie tonight, probably. And then... I'll probably rewatch the Broly movie. I watched it, I think, like two years ago. That was Battle Crush. I, I wanted to see it in the theaters when it first came out, today, but never got March the chance. On Steam, Android, and iOS. Broly movie was awesome. It's hard to believe but we've got yet another world premiere coming up next. World premiere? <gasps> so soon. Uh, after the last one. Oh my god. That's more unlikely than a marble in Rosaria. This is in TFR. The architect. Every idea starts with a single line, springing forth from our ambition. We have been deceived. At the edges. You watch one piece of TFR show. Don't don't do that to yourself. Come on. To them, an empty blueprint. Watch Flash. Did you watch the CW show or the movie? Because I think the movie's dog shit. Like a dog just took like the biggest shit ever. There's only been one movie I watched in my entire life where I wanted my time back. Keep the money. Keep the fucking money, bro. But I wanted my time back. That movie was like such a nothing burger. Now I've seen some pretty bad movies. Like Morbius, like, like I'm, I'm not even kidding when I say this. Morbius was just funny. Like it was so bad it was funny. You know what I mean? Flash damage is better at this uh, deception than Decepticons at this point. Yeah, That's a good point. That was your first look at Blueprints, a strategic adventure game where you create the world you explore. It's coming soon to PC. I hear Splash Damage is strong. Let right. me fight them. Up next, Dead. we've got an Unreal Engine 5 survivors like set in a world plagued by cosmic horrors. Dragon Ball Here's places first place Goku, which means. Luck, third place is Gohan means talent, second place is Vegeta, which means hard work. Dude, I've been like, I've been just getting back into Dragon Ball and it's like, it's been like, it's been really fun. I'm like current on the manga. It's awesome. If TFR gets revealed, you will get jagged. Dude, if you're not, if you're, if you're not curling at least 30s, bro, 30 pound dumbbells, what are you doing? What are you doing? least you're watching DBZ at the moment dude I I um I plan to either watch rewatch DBZ or DBZ Kai I don't know I don't I don't want to watch filler but like I know it's like a heated debate between Kai and regular but yeah Wish list I can't I can't rewatch super bro I just can't do it PC I don't know why 2024 our next game is all about connecting blocks and I can rewatch DBZ, but I, I can't rewatch Super. Ladder. Here's Linkito. It's my favorite TF show. Uh, probably either G1 or Armada. Junior Con trilogy is just beautiful. Mm. Kai slams. Yeah, yeah. No, that's the thing. Kai Kai has no filler. My opinion, DB. Well, here's the thing, Jax. Your your anime takes like. 
We know. I mean, we 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 don't we don't we don't take your anime take serious, bro. You you, you said Sao is better than AOT. Opinion revoked. Linkito invites you to connect on. I plan to rewatch Transformer Cybertron soon. I haven't watched that since I was a kid, dude. Next trailer, I need to ask you something. Why does Carlac have a teddy bear called Clyde? Hmm. Why does Ben have a teddy bear called Samantha? <laughs> I feel like that's him. Should be banned. I told you that. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna need some time. Well, that's okay, as we've got another dazzling world premiere up next. Let's roll that while I go sort him out. Peggy, eighteen. <laughs> Nah, Jax, don't don't try don't try and like don't try and switch up, bro. Don't try and switch up. Make you mod? What's in it for me? Oh, so you can ban him? All right, bet. Can I make you mod on this chat? I gotta pull up the actual chat. Cringe. Cringe, bro. Ah, 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 ah. Ah, 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 ah. He's modding. You guys are so screwed now. Kind of like living in the UK, right, Ben? <laughs> <laughs> it's the worst. Worshippers of Cthulhu. Yo, Rev, is that true? Its way Living in the UK is the worst. In 2024, our next game pairs Scottish folklore with a beautiful hand-drawn art style. Let's take a look at the heirloom. Said <laughs> <laughs> so beg for mercy, I might spare you. <laughs> I confirm as a British <laughs> creature. <laughs> it's over. The UK sucks at the moment. I'm just gonna go out Australia. R Rich said he has a he has a spare bedroom. So I th I think I'm just gonna go to Australia. I think that's the move. You can inherit the heirloom when it lands on PC, Xbox, PlayStation, and Nintendo Switch later this year. You got rid of right. Discord too Here's toxic. A for Spine, a Is my server toxic to you, bro? Where you I think everyone's nice. An oppressive regime with the help of a talking backbone. Cougar, you locked in though, right? You kept you kept doing those push-ups, right? No other stuff. Okay. Want to fight a kangaroo? Yo, tell me why same, dude. I want to fight a kangaroo as well. You know how like when you play like Dark Souls or Elden Ring and you like walk in and it's like a boss fight that you walk through the clouds or whatever like the mist? The fog, that's what I'm like. You walk through like the fog. I think that's like, the thing for Australia. Like once you like you land in Australia, you just walk through like the fog. And it's like Australia. <laughs> and you just like kangaroos and giant ass spiders you gotta fight. <laughs> like just something like that. So suck, yeah, pretty bad. Watch over many talk servers was just not one of them. Yeah, everyone's just super like everyone everyone in the in, in our server is just very chill. Spine will be spin kicking. Like like even when people have like like hot Xbox takes, whatever, it's, it's still pretty like civil. You know what I mean? Moving on to something a little just more bunch sinister, of goobers. We've got the latest update on Indica. A psychological puzzle game where you play as a rogue nun. Um, so, uh, make what's what I said. Just, dude, that's what I'm saying. Like, you, dude, you can literally make a game about that. Like, you go to Australia, you just fight big ass spiders, kangaroos. Like, one of the boss fights, like a mutated kangaroo. It's like big as fuck. Like, dude, come on. Dude. Hell yeah. 
of the Bam Yoru hot take. Well, I, you're, you're the exception. You know what I mean? Damn, better be a good ass apple. Better be a good ass apple if you're closing your eyes and biting it. Come on. Besides, like the proper the proper way to eat an apple is like you gotta have it sliced up. You know what I mean? Have it like slices. Best survive for five years in the Halo for twenty five million dollars. Do it for free. Like on the Halo ring. That's kind of tough for five years. Tough. Elden Ring is inspired by Australia. I believe it. <laughs> I believe it. Oh, just the Halo universe? Shit. I mean, you can do that. You just post up on one of the planets. Is it in my power to intervene in your design? Is this a part of your plan? TFR isn't real in 10 minutes. You're going to get off. Dude, it's it's looking pretty bleak, bro. I, I wasn't expecting TFR, though, here. I, I got to be honest. I wasn't expecting it. I just want to see if there's any, like, good games coming out. I see everyone, like... I see everyone meet ride Bloodborne. I, I don't see it. I don't see the hype. It's like the aesthetics. TFR feels dead. It ain't dead, bro. The hype may be dead, but... We, 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 we carry that. You know what I mean? Uh, us TFR fans, we, we carry that burden. You know what I mean? What's, what's, what's the quote from JJK? Like, we are the exception. Like, yeah. Befriending a demon. Tiefling! Tiefling! Like, how many times do I have to tell you? Ben, it's a tiefling! It's different from a demon! Is she tweaking? Hasn't gone so badly. You are not the only one cursed with knowledge. Indica, which is coming to PC <laughs> in Q2 2024. I hate to break it to you, Ben, but this next one is our last trailer. If you're, yeah, if you're friends it's with the Arbiter, you'll be cool out. Super world premiere, though, which takes the sting out of saying goodbye. I'm deeply sad about this, but somehow that feeling is being slowly usurped by the promise of a new video game to look at. Curious. <laughs> you want the truth, <laughs> my Elysian. Peace is a Renji, I don't know if you're current on the manga, bro. But, yeah. Something you tell young rats to stifle the nightmares. Young rats? It's high time you woke up. What? For the nightmare is upon us. What? You're all caught up? <laughs> yeah, bro, then you know. <laughs> yeah. I can't, I can't, I, dude, I can't, bro. Every every week, every two weeks, that, the new chapter is just something else. That manga is just something else. It's glorious. Take care, Blake. And a thirst for vengeance that will not sate. There's a time for heroes. That time more than meets the eye. That's the. Was that like IDW reboot or no? The kingdom meets a warrior. Forged of the north. Did IDW ever reboot, or am I thinking of something else? Shrouds these lands. A rat. Side W1, got it. Pression, I love destruction that suit can have made, yeah. Yo, take care of our brothers. Do your brother. And so, a new tale begins. Tales of Iron 2, Whiskers of Winter. Wish list now. <laughs> I like I can't even that was your first peek at tales of iron 2 whiskers of winter Which is coming to PC PlayStation 5 PlayStation 4 Xbox series X and S Xbox one and Nintendo switch in 2024 But with that we will have to bid you all adieu Sam I can feel I can feel you 
laughing and smiling uncomfortably. Why? Uh, nothing. It's just, <laughs> well, it's not nothing, actually. Um, it's not the end of the show because we have another trailer. It's like a one more thing thing, you know, all the big One more trailer? Do it, huh? Right. And you, uh, you just kept this to yourself the whole time. You know, we've been, mm. um, we've been emailing about this and we've been like Amazing. rehearsing it. Yeah. And I just, I feel like I'm I, I know, I know. And best of all, it's another world <laughs> premiere. Gotcha. I got to take no, a make sure Sam. to lose your hairline over it. You've embarrassed me. Gotcha. No, Sam. Gotcha. Not gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. Not gotcha. gotcha. Don't go. Gotcha. <laughs> gotcha. 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 Yo, they, they're, they're tweaking, bro. Cougar, I believe in the manga, Vegeta finally got a dub on Goku. What is this? This is the, I believe, the last trailer for Spring Showcase. Nah, this isn't Summer Games Fest. Summer Games Fest is in June. We got hiccups. I will say the the DBS manga is really fun. Like it's it's really cool. Free hair Krillin was peak Krillin. <laughs> That was Industria 2, which is coming soon to PC. So make sure it's on your wish lists. And no, no more funny business. That really was our final trailer of the show. For real this time. It's been an absolute pleasure, Sam. Likewise, Ben. But before we make good on our karaoke promise, we'd like to thank everyone for tuning in. I think, I think we're going to react uh, to the Spark and Zero like gameplay. Let's see if I can pull that up real quick. This spring showcase a reality. And our partners over at PAX. Remember to head over to the dedicated Future Game Show Steam page to add the games we've covered to your wish lists. Finally, just before we go, we'd like to take a moment to recognize what a difficult period it has been game and yet? continues no. to be in the games industry with countless layoffs and a growing fog of uncertainty. Somehow, couple I'm glad that they're talking about this because there's been a lot profits. of layoffs. We simply couldn't have a show like this full of awesome trailers and demos and presentations without the hardworking people who turn such inspired ideas into reality. The makers of this show and both Ben and I, we want to acknowledge just how difficult it's become to work and feel supported in this industry. So for everyone out there weathering this storm, regardless of what you do, we just want to say that we see you, we're thinking of you, and we truly hope that things are going to get better. So please support your favorite games and the people who make them in whatever see, way. See, like, that's actually like a I'm dub. And I'm Samantha Bayer. And this, this has, has been, been the Future, Future Game Show, Show Spring, Spring Showcase 2024. 2024. But, 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 hold yeah, on Yeah, nothing was really shown, Cam. Whilst we're leaving you for pastures new, the Future Game Show expansion Yeah, we did a reboot, but it was selling so bad, Skybound Pichon. Wait, really? Even more world premiere. It's just 60 seconds away, so we probably don't have time to entertain you good people during the interim. I mean, the auto is blank, so... Uh, maybe I just, um, should I just, uh, I'll just, I'll start getting undressed now. Oh, God, every Give time. the people what they want, Sam. Give the people what they want. Expansion show? Nah, bro, yeah, nah. See, not, not even, I just want to say, it's, pro it's probably literally just indie games, more indie games. What's that? She's a 10. All right, let's watch Spark and Zero before, before we wrap it up. I saw the gameplay. I didn't watch the full thing, bro. God, yo, this looks so good. I've never played, never played any of these games, but this looks so good. 
Actually, wait, that's not true. I think my brother had this on PlayStation 2. Yo, they got beam struggles, bro. Oh, yeah, we can watch the Hydra game this. I'll show you the horrors of hell. This looks so good. Who put Cell in my Xbox? Was it my dad? No. Dad doesn't touch my stuff. I think I'm gonna buy uh, Kakarot and play that. Dragon Ball Sparking Zero のメインプロデューサーの古谷と申します。本日はよろしくお願いいたします。先ほど皆様に見ていただいたのは、昨年12月のゲームアワードで正式発表された。So IW lost the rights and Hasbro didn't want to renew it, and so IW is trying to go bankrupt. 今年の1月、Dragon Ball Games バトラワー2024では、宿命のライバルである悟空とベジータにフォーカスした。It was like IDW kind of like lost its like magic. I kind of disagree with that though, because like Glass Pot standing was phenomenal, and Shattered Glass was amazing. So I disagree. ドラゴンボールスパーキングゼロは単なる新作のゲームではなく、欧米では武道会展開地として、日本およびアジア地域ではスパーキングでおなじみのシリーズ最新作となっております。そして本日はバトルシステムに関して初公開となるゲームプレイ映像とともにそのユニークなメカニズムを明らかにしていきたいと思いますそれではまず悟空とベジータによる激しいバトル映像を見ていただければと思いますどうぞいやこれが最初に見たカカロット私は勝利するこの日ドゥーナウヤオ This game will have like PVE stuff too, so which is cool. Oh my god. So, like, you use that to charge up your bars. Okay. This looks so fucking awesome, bro. I can't get over that. Take care, Cam. Was that the TF stream? Uh, it was nothing, bro. It was actually a waste of time. Piccolo fans rise up. You strike me as a Piccolo fan of here. That makes sense. It's like a mobile game? Nah. Bro, Final Flash. They do not want to see me as Gohan in this game. Straight up. <laughs> Straight up, bro. That's what I'm saying. Heck is the end of the IDW one. That's what a lot of people say. It's like, it, that's just like the ending of the IDW story. I believe it was the last. I think it was the last story they worked on because I believe Shattered Glass they already had like done. They were just releasing them. Could be wrong on that. It was? Okay. Dragon Ball would not be the same without Toriyama. Oh, dude, it wouldn't be the same without Toriyama. I'm probably, probably uh, I'm gonna butcher his like his name, but uh, his successor, the guy he like kind of took under his wing, uh, Toitaru. Uh, he's he's been working on like Dragon Ball though for a while, and like he he just did the latest manga chapter for DBS, and it's good.
Do they got beef struggles, bro? What? That's so awesome. They got beef struggles, bro. Vegeta, let's go again. That okay with you? いかがだったでしょうかまず本作はやはりシリーズの正当進化作品ですので過去シリーズのいい点はそのままに残しており、you、続きドラゴンボールらしいゲームでダイナミックな 3D アクションバトルを楽しみにしていただけることを念頭に開発を進めており主攻撃や不正コンボによる禁止作業だけでなくドラゴンダッシュを使った高速移動やファンの皆様なら思わず懐かしんでいただけるような伝統のカウンターシステム<笑>そしてさらには激しい戦線や飛行波の打ち合いを楽しめるインパクトアクションなど派手なバトルシステムはそのままにバトルのやり込み要素だけではなく見ているだけでも楽しめるよう演出面にも気を配っていますアルティメットブラストはまさにそのうちの一つで最新のプラットフォームだからこそ実現できるド派手演出となっていますゲームで実現させたドラゴンボールらしいダイナミックかつ激しいバトルをしてそしてシリーズとして大事にしている要素だけでなくせっかくのゲームプレイ説明の機会なので今作ならではの新要素もお伝えできればと思いますまず先ほど基本的なメカニクスはシリーズからその DNA を引き継いでいる旨をお伝えしましたがドラゴンボールアクションの爽快感やダイナミックなバトルを表現可能にするためにはどうしたらいいかいくつかの変更や新要素を加えました今回はその中から4つほど先ほどお見せしたバトルの映像を使用しながらお伝えできればと思います大きな変更点としては通常移動を高速化して前作のダッシュ相当のスピードにしてこれまでダッシュとして使われていたボタンで瞬間的に高速で動くことができるショートダッシュを行えるようにしましたこれによってより柔軟な移動や動きながらの攻撃など複雑なアクションが実現できるようになりましたショートダッシュで相手の攻撃をかわしたり動きつつため攻撃や気弾攻撃につなげたりドラゴンダッシュにつなげて一気に大きく移動したりなどプレイヤーのスタイルに合わせてさまざまなアクションができますまた基本アクションだけでなく戦闘中に時間でたまるスキルストックを使ったアクションを追加しています相手の攻撃を食らいながらも反撃するリベンジカウンターは検索でもよく描かれている食べられながらも攻撃を繰り出すようなよりドラゴンボールらしい高速攻撃を繰り出すようなさまざまな攻撃を繰り出すようなさまざまな攻撃を繰り出すようなさまざまな攻撃を繰り出すようなさまざまな攻撃を繰り出すようなさまざまな攻撃を繰り出すようなさまざまな攻撃を繰り出すようなさまざまな攻撃を繰り出すようなさまざまな攻撃を繰り出戦いの選択肢を広げて駆け引きの面白さを深める新要素となっておりますさらに瞬時に接近して吸収できるバニシングアサルトというものを追加しています発動には一定量の手が必要になりますがこれは遠距離攻撃をするか接近性を持つか悩ましい遠距離におけるアルファの選択をお楽しみいただけると思いますこれらの新要素により,よりバトルをよりドラゴンボールらしくより戦略的にお楽しみいただけると思っています今回のデモンストレーションでスパーキングシリーズファンの皆さんが疑問に思っていたことに対してはしっかりお答えできたのではと思っておりますまたドラゴンボールらしいド派手な 3D バトルゲームを求めていたシリーズの経験者の方々にとっても興味を持っていただくことができたのであれば幸いですバトルシステムに加えてもう一つ強調したいポイントを挙げさせていただくとやはりキャラクターは見逃せないかと思いますこれまでの映像では新キャラクターや再登場キャラクターを多数紹介してきましたがアニメ「ドラゴンボールスーパー」からもキャラクターが登場しますまたこの後すぐに最新のキャラクター PV を初お披露目させていただきますドラゴンボールらしいダイナミックで迫力満点なバトルを皆様にお届けできるよう開発に取り組んでおりますので今後ともぜひドラゴンボールスーパーにお伝えくださいそれではどうぞ Future trunks. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is the true might of a Super Saiyan strength. 
Oh no. A mindless beast like you is nothing but prey to a warrior of love. Trunks didn't piece up. No. How many ladies are all around me? I'm old, yes, but experienced. Founder of the Turtle School, creator of the sacred technique. Hurry, hurry, ha! Yeah. Let playtime begin. Oh shit, Snapper. Whether it's this universe or another, I'm always the fastest. Don't think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna read Berserk then watch it. Nothing when you're as quick as me. Oh, Alex, oh, yeah, Master Roshi's that guy. He's that guy, Rich. Rampaging monster must be tough. He put Goku on the path. Come on, my ear again, you. Get your together. I am not going to be left in your dice. This game looks so good. Oh, my God, this game looks so good. Yeah, let's do it. I'm purple. Come in. Kale. Any TMR yet? Nah, it, it already it already finished. You Got the boy Broly. Better wrap this up quickly. Don't think you can enter my crosshairs and just walk away. You cannot win. This is peak, bro. Like we've awakened a real bona fide monster. Oh. We still have a release date. Tough. Tough, man. Just released Dragon Ball Fighter Z. Oh, man. Dude, wait, hold on. I want to go back to the gameplay here. This looks big. Nah, this is big. Let's go to the beam struggles. Oh my god. They got fucking beam struggles, man! That's so fucking awesome! Dove. Literally, that, like, for that alone, that, that gets... That gets, uh, my money. All right, let's see this real quick. Might have to private this stream. I'm probably going to get hit with, like, claims anyways. They're combing the streets. It's whatever. Searching Ultra house Eagle. to house. Dude. I, okay, so, Renji, if I was talking to someone about that. They will take Apparently, they can't do, like, manga stuff. So, like, we won't return. get Black Frieza or Ultra Ego Vegeta. I'm more concerned with the six-foot cat man who's got claws that can cut through vibranium alloy. I am not a fan of the VA for Captain America. That's like my only gripe. That's my only gripe with this. By my count, that makes two super soldiers loose in Paris. Three. Counting you. And that's two too many. I'll be there before the sun rises. Before the Germans, the before bastards. that American, the Eye of Force has been found. Sounds fine. I don't know. I just I don't Please. like it. Just stick to the rooftops. Be careful. Stand by me. When am I not? The Black Panther suit is fucking awesome. It's better if I tackle this. Anything good? Uh, you may. Encounter some obstacles. That won't be a problem. Our cat friend is definitely here, too. By the look of things, he's not very far ahead. The American boy is right on your heels. 
Who the hell are you? If you wanted us dead, we'd be dead. So what do you want? Answers. I like the cave. That's I think the cave enough. works. Stay out of my it's very way. comic Stand accurate. It's awesome. I do not take orders you really like from as, anyone. As you actor. I don't have time for this. Neither do I. I think it's just I just don't like the voice. Everything else I'm fine with. Like the the Black Panther VA, awesome. That's the guy that voiced Cyborg in uh, Teen Titans. Iron Man game? Are we getting anything on the Iron Man game? I don't think so. Well, that is everything. Might as well send us out with a bang. Well, the the spring game showcase. I mean, you had um. I mean, there was like a couple decent games. Dragon's Dogma comes out tomorrow. I don't know why they show that again. I'm shocked when you get anything for First Ascendant. That is unfortunate. Devastation stream de uh, tomorrow. Devastation streams tomorrow. We're still on the hunt for an axe, so we can have a comic accurate build. But Star Saber is fine, you know. Hype for TF1, so am I. Tomorrow will be Devastation Stream. If I can't get the comic video out tomorrow, then for sure Saturday. So, be on the lookout for that. I got the script done. I just I just got to start putting it together. Um, I appreciate everyone coming by. Y'all be good as always. Much love. Leave a like on your way out. And yeah, I'll catch you guys tomorrow. I'm going to let this play out on that end stream. Plex feeds the call of the last prize.